think it's time for wine. Ginger, I've been sitting there waiting for this. We're going to get emotional. We are. I was going to say, I can feel <laughs> yeah. it in my throat. Hello everybody, hope you're all well. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Christmas with Mr. Carrington. I hope you're all doing really well. I'm back with a vlog today. I'm actually going to be off on my travels tomorrow. I'm heading to Germany and this video has been kindly sponsored by My Postcard. So My Postcard is an app for creating and sending personalized cards using your own photos. So they reached out to me and said they've really been enjoying the vlogs with my friends here on YouTube and would I like to create some greetings cards for them for Christmas. So I said, absolutely. They've actually just launched an audio greeting card where you can record an audio message which will play when the recipient opens the card, which I think is such a brilliant idea. I don't know about you, but I send a lot of voice notes back and forth to my friends. So the idea of actually getting your voice into a physical greeting card that you can send to them, I just think is genius. So I'm so excited to try it out. But before we get into the video, if you're new here, do click subscribe. I'm posting videos every week and throughout December, I'm uploading every day and give this video a little thumbs up if you enjoy it. So I'm just having my coffee. I'm getting my head around everything that I've got to do today. I've got to head down to the post office to send off some packages for Christmas. And also I've got to post off all of the prizes for the giveaways. Congratulations to all of the chosen winners. Those are on the way, so hopefully they will reach you all before Christmas. And then I've got to pack. And then shortly I'm going to be meeting Luke in central London. We're gonna do a quick shoot before it's raining. <laughs> of course it's raining. Um, that's standard for us, but I'm sure we'll manage to get the shots. We're gonna find somewhere sheltered, hopefully, to do it. Okay, so let's have a go at making one of the audio cards. I think this is such a good idea if you are looking to send a last minute surprise to somebody, especially somebody maybe that you haven't seen in a while or maybe that you're not going to be seeing over the festive period. Lovely way to just add that personal little touch. So all you need to do is download the My Postcard app and then you can scroll down to the new feature which is Send an audio card. I've already actually made one of these for Kate as well. So Kate, if you're watching, um, you're not allowed to watch this video anymore. And also Luke, if you're watching, you're not allowed to watch either because I'm just about to create a card for you as well. So click off the video and everybody else, you can carry on watching <laughs> if you want. <laughs> um, okay, so you click personalize now and then you can choose your selected style. So you can go for different photo layouts as you can see. So there's um, up to, I think, 12 photos that you can fit onto one of these. So I'm just scrolling through to pick one that I think would be good for Luke's card. And I think I'm going to go for, let's go for this multi one. Oh, there's someone at the door. Two seconds. Oh, sorry, oh, my phone, hang on. Sorry about that, that was the postman dropping in a parcel for the neighbor, which, I always take, so I'm very grateful when the neighbors take mine as well. So all you need to do now is go into your camera roll and start adding the photos. And a little tip for you, if your phone has the face recognition, you can go into the folder of that person. So as you can see here, we've got some fun memories. That was from earlier in the year when we took a trip down to see Kate in Norfolk when we crashed the boat, who remembers that? And then we've got, oh, this one looks old. I think that's when, that's when we were working in um, Peckham and we just took a random <laughs> picture on the colorful staircase. And I think this here, I think that was our first collab that we did. So this is a really nice way to pull up different memories as well. So I'll look at that. Wardrobe declutter, iconic. I think we've probably done about six of those videos <laughs> by now. And of course the infamous macrame video. So I'm going to favourite a few um, favourites. <laughs> okay, um, let's go for this one. Um, so this was from the Blogosphere Awards, so that was obviously a massive highlight for both of us this year, so I'm going to pick that one out. So now I've added them all onto the card. Just edit each one, so you can fiddle around with like the sizes and stuff. You just click edit photo and then you can like reposition it. You can also filter them in the app as well, which is really handy. You can also add some text. 
So I'm just going to write Merry Christmas. And you can change the colour of the border as well. And then you can put a photograph on the inside as well. Let's do us dressed as elves enjoying a mould cider. <laughs> There's also this section here where you can personally sign it. So just using your finger, you can sign it, which I think just makes it really nice and a little bit more personal. And then in the text section, you can write your message. And now onto the fun part, which is where you can record your personalized voice message up to 60 seconds long. Hello, mate. Oh, is it recording? I need to press record. <laughs> Hello, mate. If all's gone to plan, then hopefully you'll be receiving this card back home. Oh, my screen lock went on. <laughs> I think I've just messed this up. Right, let's, let's just play it back. Is it done it? <laughs> I think I've just messed this up. Hello, mate. If all has gone to plan, hopefully you're opening this card. It's locked again. Just make sure your screen lock's not on it while you're recording. Third time lucky. I hope you're having a lovely Christmas and by now you're up to your eyeballs in cheese boards and mince pies and mulled wine and gin. Maybe a cheeky Prosecco. Let's not forget the Baileys. And then you can preview the card to check that you're all happy with it. So it'll just play it back to you, open it up. So that's all done and that will be posted directly to Luke. He'll receive that over Christmas time, which will be lovely. And if you want to check out the app, then I'll leave all the information in the description box. The audio cards are exclusive to the app, so you will need to download that if you want to have a go at making one yourself. And then later on, hopefully the one that I've made for Kate will be arriving, so I'll actually be able to show you the physical card and how it works when that arrives a little bit later. But now, I'll just show you some of the presents that I've wrapped before we head off. I've made a start. Um, I'm going to be seeing my parents after Christmas. So I've got a few bits wrapped up already and then this I thought looked quite nice the idea of stacking presents What do we think and I've gone for like a ribbon and then some string to tie the two packages together Love classic brown paper and then we've got some stripy paper And then on this one I've recycled a bow from a hamper and I always think um, Christmas decorations make nice little touches almost like a gift tag on a present. And also I've got some of these pegs left over, so I thought they looked really cool as well, as a little touch. I'm feeling relatively calm now. I feel like now that the bulk of filming videos is out of the way, I can kind of breathe a little bit. It has been quite a manic end of November. December, but I think it is definitely time to start winding down a bit. I hope you are. Have you finished work yet? If you're working, let me know. Do you feel prepared for Christmas? Do we ever feel prepared for Christmas? That is the real question. Probably not, but um, it's one of those things where we just keep going and then it comes. <laughs> Obviously. I don't know what I'm talking about. I think we should head on into town. Okay, I've made it to the train station. I've just missed my train by approximately 20 seconds. So I'm just waiting for the next one. I've got my large brolly here. I made myself a little coffee to take with me. It was one of those, do I make a coffee? Do I, yeah, I missed the train. I did that thing where you run and you know when you haven't run in a while and it literally burns your windpipe. United. Yeah, nice. 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 Yeah, nice.
Brits. <laughs> what are we saying? Hello. <laughs> Oh, that was a tough two-hour shoot. <laughs> Hour per outfit. I'm crazy. I'm knackered. I feel like we deserve a wine. It's been a tough old morning. <laughs> and the rain's just starting. Yeah. We're doing well. Good timing. Absolutely. I think it's time for a wine. I smell the old wine. <laughs> They were all quite busy, so we've now come to one just off of Regent Street called the. What's it called? Uh, the Leicester Arm. The Leicester Arm. The Leicester Arm. Back to front on the window. Yeah. Here, so. We haven't um, had that much wine. <laughs> a nice large white wine each. And we're going to open our presents. I might have to time that because it's quite noisy in here. Thank you. He's got me a stocking. I am. Is he Brock? <laughs> So I'm going to time lapse this, but I'm going to unwrap mine here and Luke's going to open his presents over on his vlog, so I'll link that in the description box. This reminds me of the time it was my birthday and I put my hand in the bag and pricked my fingers on the cactus. Who remembers that? Luke's going in for his presents. He's going to open them up over on his channel. I've just spotted a very good Christmas jumper. It's just peeping out from behind the table. It's a little Santa. <laughs> <laughs> That was nice. Well needed. Yeah. Very well needed. It was fab. Oh, so we're heading home now. I've got to go home and pack. You do all careful. We've got a step. That's why I look a little bit short. Oh yeah, I'll step there. <laughs> what are you up to? Um, I am having an evening of gin and tonics. Very nice. Gin and tonics. Yes. Sounds like it's much needed. <laughs> After our two large white wines. Oh my gosh. Um, I'll well, see you in 2020. That's quite crazy, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. It's been a. It's but you'll been... be hearing from me before then. Um, right. That's it. That's it. I mean, is it Happy I, New Year. <laughs> I was about to say, we're, we're ending it there, guys. Oh, that's that's it. it. We're done. We're done. <laughs> no, it has. I was, we, we basically, I'll recite the conversation we've just had. We both sat and had probably about two hours in there just saying yeah. how incredible this year has been. Yeah, it really has. Lucky and grateful. And we how feel. grateful we are. Yeah. yeah. To not only be doing what we're doing, but to have friends that we have and be in the position that we are. And yeah. it is down to people at home who watch as well. Yeah, it it's is. lovely. It's been, it's, been a, it's been a lovely, well needed. End of the year. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get emotional. On that note. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll see you back home. Yeah, it's very true though. It is. We are incredibly grateful Absolutely. and thankful for all of you that watch. Yeah, I should stop rabbiting on there. Nope. That's We're gonna fine. get emotional. We are. I was gonna say I can feel <laughs> yeah. a lump in my throat. Yeah, right. Okay. I'll catch you back home. <laughs> So 
I've made it to the post office. There's still a queue. Lady behind me just told me that the queue has been here all day. So, we just have to wait. Fingers crossed I'll get into the door. They'll lead me straight to you, to you. And the We're back home. home. Boy, was that a long queue in the post office. I think I was in there for a good half an hour. But all the giveaway prizes have been posted, so those are on the way to the winners, which is very exciting. And the postman's been here as well. So I've now received the card that I created for Kate, so I can show you an example of the card that I made. So here it is. So I've picked out some favourite memories. You can see us in the new studio, which was quite recently, and this one from our fun day out that we had in London, and then classic us um, out shopping together, and then also us um, having a nice spot of brunch in Wimbledon Village. So some favourite memories on there, but now let's open it up and let's test out the audio greeting. So I'll be posting this onto Kate, so she will be opening this when she's away for Christmas. jealous you're probably on a beach somewhere i just wanted to wish you a very merry christmas and a happy new year thank you for being such a brilliant friend i hope you like all the memories on the card and i'm looking forward to making some new ones next year have the best time and i'll see you soon bye how cool is that that's really good isn't it it sounds really clear and i really like this bit as well that you can sign yourself so that is my handwriting on there and you've got quite a lot of space here to write your message as well and you can choose up to nine photos um, to go on the front so you can capture lots of memories on there and also you can put a photo inside so yeah if you want to send an audio card to someone special this christmas then i'll leave all of the information for my postcard in the description box and thank you again to my postcard for sponsoring the video. I think I'm going to end the vlog here because I've got lots of packing to do before I head off to the airport tomorrow. So I really hope you enjoyed this one. I've had such a lovely day. It's been really, really nice and I feel like I'm finally starting to wind down to enjoy the Christmas period. Most of the videos have been filmed now so I'll be doing a last few little bits of editing and hopefully getting all of those uploaded for you as the countdown continues. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the vlog. If you did, do give it a little thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.